Hello my creative friends, Olga Sobi here and you know which technique I haven't done for a while? It's a swipe and today I totally feel like doing it. I'm in a mood for some bright and contrasting colors and one of my most favorite things to use for a swipe technique is this uh, Artist Loft Ready Mixed Paint. Uh, it's available in Michael's stores in US and Canada. Unfortunately, I don't think it's available in any other countries. So I think this paint is particularly good for anything, any technique, any acrylic pouring technique with cells. But as long as you use silicone, it's not going to work for cells without silicone at all. And in case if you're waiting for my second experiment with the Deco Art Ready Mix paints, uh, I did one experiment with them and I was going to do a second one. And actually I did, but I dropped one canvas and I totally ruined the other one. So it did not work very well. But I think I'm going to uh, give it another go and hopefully the next try is going to be better. So I, I hope it's coming in the near future. So back to these colors. I'm going to use this blue as my swipe color. It's named bright blue, but actually it's not that bright. It dries really dark, but I think it's going to look very nice on lighter and brighter colors. In case you want to check out um, all the other supplies that I'm using, such as, you know, those small silicone bowls or my silicone oil or, you know, mixing sticks, torch and everything like that, I'm going to include everything in the description, so check it out and let's get started. All right, so first I'm going to mix my colors with silicone oil and I think I'm going to add just one drop of silicone per color. I feel like I might need to mix in some more colors, but I'll just start with this and see how it goes. All right, now let's layer colors on the canvas. And in case you're wondering, I actually get this question a lot. I do not normally apply a base coat for the swipe technique. So right now I'm adding colors right on the canvas. So next, after aqua green, I really like adding gold because I really like how these two colors by Artist Loft work together. So always trying to put them next to each other whenever I'm using them. So now the most important part, the swipe itself. Today I'm using just a clear plastic sheet and just trying to drag this blue color over really gently and slowly. Oh, some small cells already showing up. 
Yeah, I really like seeing some of the cells popping up already, but the magic is gonna happen when I'm gonna torch it. This is like my most favorite moment of this whole swipe technique. Let's go. Ooh, look at all the cells showing up. Oh my goodness, I just love it. Oh, they are so pretty. Now they're gonna slowly grow. Oh. This is awesome. I feel like I want to add some of the blue color to the bottom of the canvas because I think it's going to really help to frame all of those super bright cells in the center. Alright guys, I think I'm going to stop right here. I'm just so happy about all the happy sunset color cells. They, I know they're going to be growing as the canvas dries. And yeah, now let's see how it looks when dry. We'll be back soon. Alright my friends, here is this bright beauty dry. Oh my god, it has dried so awesome. First of all, as always with Artist Love Paint, it's very shiny and I did not varnish it or didn't, didn't add anything on top. This is just how this paint dries and check it out. I love it. I love the shine in gold and other colors also look pretty cool. I just love this adorable little cute cells at the top with some blue and uh, white and I also like this area, this row of cells with green and gold. So the aqua green overmixed with yellow, not with yellow, with gold and created a pretty bright green. And normally I'm not a huge fan of green. You probably noticed I almost never use it in my pores, but over here, oh my God, it's so pretty. And I also like that, you know, there are cells and cells and cells and it creates so much depth. So yeah, there it is. Here it is dry. Let me know what you think about it. As always, I would love to hear from you and I hope to see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Happy pouring, stay safe, stay creative and see you next time. Bye-bye.